For on next adventure we travel away northward of the United Kingdom to a lush beautiful country bursting with green spaces, lush forests, towering mountains and vast lakes. Yes, that's right, Scotland. You will see how we venture away inside this huge aquarium, also known as SeaWorld. The place where seals would perform each and every day, entertaining all the customers, is now nothing more than a bear pool. Walking through corridors, which were once contained with thousands of fish, gives a very sad and misunderstanding feeling. A place which has been attracting customers for more than 40 years was forced to close down in 2018 due to a substantial reduction in customer numbers. Without having any duties to buy a ticket, we took a glance inside the mysterious walls of the neglected sea world in Scotland. standing finally in the first spot in Scotland which works out and this is a spot we have never visited before this is an abandoned sea world aquarium yeah it's pretty cool inside we already did a check inside lights are still on actually and there are just so many fish tanks left there is yeah, just a lot of artifacts we definitely had to do with big fishes, that's one thing for sure. We kind of document something for you that you have never seen before, which is bad, and so enjoy watching this video. There is actually already a sign with information about sharks. Yeah, I think these are very tropical animals actually. So firstly, we want to show you the outside of this place. There's a giant lake down there where you have a bridge. I just really want to walk this, see where it leads to. Those pipes, they were actually all for the water supply, probably from for the outside water show because they were sea life shows and performances. Yeah, I think there is massive water it's the reservoirs inside of here. This is one big water thing. Wow. Can you imagine how many gallons of seawater used to be inside of here? Oh wow. Take a look at this. So this was the complete pool for the sea lion shows. It's crazy. There was a stage. They even would do tricks and everything here. So we have made our way inside. Where is even signs of a sea lion? Yeah, and uh, the turtle. And this is gonna be such a crazy place. You can definitely see all the artifacts. I guess this was a filter or something to measure. Yeah, it was for the temperature, oh, thermometer. Yeah. Interesting. I mean, this is even something we have never seen. We've been to so many abandoned places no. the last year, but this is something quite very, unique. Very new. It's huge tanks. Yeah, used to be a lot of fish inside of them. Imagine if this place was still running. There's really tanks everywhere here. And all of the different number on them. There's even nets.
Scorpion fish. Huh. Really? They had scorpions here? No scorpion fish. Something different? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man, this is a huge tank. You can barely look above it. Yeah, this <laughs> it's is a massive one. Very big one. Over here you can still see the water inside the tanks. Oh yeah, the water is just still present in these tanks. Some shells inside. I think it was just to store all the fishes before they were going inside the aquarium. Yeah. And as a matter of fact, the electricity is still running in this place. It has been abandoned now for more than one year. We don't know where exit date unfortunately, but... Oh, it smells like fish in there. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, don't you smell it? A little bit, yeah. Can you open yeah. this uh, freezer? Category 3 animals byproducts, not for human consumption. Okay. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. oh, yeah. I guess this was just all the food for the animals. Crazy. Everything's just still in there. Okay, so over here is actually another fridge. I'm gonna try to open it. Wondering if there's also animal products inside of this one. Oh, the light is still working inside of it, but there's not really something left inside. Oh, 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 oh. that one was disgusting. Oh. I want to go inside of it. Oh, that one was way more terrible than the first one. So, luckily, I don't smell it anymore, but this was just another side part. Oh, that is interesting. We can see the anatomy of the fishes. Hmm. Actually, really interesting. Where is another picture? From all different species, you can see the anatomy, different structures, the organs. How they were located. Oh, that is actually very cool. That is for samples. So they used to take samples of the water to check it yeah. if it had the proper condition for the animals to live in. Refractometer used to be inside of here. And then another one. Yeah, there's not so many left. Only some shells. And a dead fish head over there. Oh yeah, there's actually a fish. Crazy. So we can walk up the little stairs here. On the wooden bait show. Oh wow. Over here you can take a closer look. How the big tank over here used to look like. There is still water in it. Can you imagine? the big animal creatures which used to be inside of here even was giving a warning here please do not touch creatures in this tank they have a protective mucus on their skin which helps them to keep parasites away touching them will compromise the spot of their immune system and they may become ill I'm wondering what animals it were coal fish alright so I'm just gonna go through this interesting and they Sometimes may even bite. <laughs> well, we don't have to be scared of that anymore. Over here, you had aquariums, I guess. Right? It's crazy. You just used to look through here and would see fishes swimming, lies, and everything inside. And now it's not more than only this. Just the behind the scenes. <laughs> Boots still standing here, probably from an employee of this aquarium. One million liters of seawater travels through this pipe every day. That's a lot. It's 
it's just crazy to see all these signs are still being left there. And I think also a lot of younger people came here. What is that? Is that oh. Halloween decoration? <laughs> I think so. It looks like Dracula. Yeah, it is. <laughs> this just used to be, I don't know, I think there were bigger animals living here. Please do not climb on the glass or allow children to clamber up the front of the tank. Hmm. Might have been dangerous animals as well, if yeah. you came too close. Seal hospital. So it were seals actually, which were living there. Oh, and this was actually the hospital. They would be treated here, even they would be showered here. You can still see the equipment left. This was a list of all the seals they rescued. I mean, it's crazy. You can see at which dates they were rescued. And it all goes up to 2017 over there. So that's actually the last day we find. You can see how they rescue these seals. Much respect to these people to help them and rescue them and give them a better life here. All right, let's continue inside of here. Pretty cool decoration already. Over here there would be even more tanks. You could see the pipe systems where the water was flowing through. Okay, now we're really getting inside the aquarium. Take a look at all the leaves above us. It's like we're walking on the water right now. This is very cool. Yeah, like an African style. Oh wow, take a look inside of these aquariums, it's crazy. This is very cool. Yeah. But what type of animals should have been in there? I think this was just an aquarium for normal fishes, all different species. There's even a temple built inside of it. Even seahorses here on the ground. And also at the door, as we don't like getting cold, so probably it was seahorses being inside this aquarium. Yeah, and definitely also behind this door. Well, this just seems like a behind the scenes part. Wow, it's getting cooler and cooler guys. Take a look, there's even more aquariums here. I mean, with all this decoration still inside. The decoration was really cool. Yeah. I can imagine walking here with my parents as a kid and I would love to see all the fishes. This is a giant tank over here. I guess there was big fishes inside of it. Wow. I'm just so amazed about everything actually. Yeah, because we've never seen something like this being abandoned. There used to be walls inside. Everywhere in this spot. which is just filled with shells. Take a look. And is that a shrimp there? Yeah, but a huge one. This is actually pretty funny. I can imagine that they had a lot of these. Yeah. <laughs> Would have been slippery here working with all the water. Yeah. Well, there was only one thing I'm asking myself, and that was also with the other thing. I think they not only use a sea animals over here, look. And then also in the other one. 
Do you think that there have been sea animals in here? I don't know. So as you can see, electricity is still running in this place, which is absolutely crazy. It feels like walking in there after closing hours. Yeah. Well, right now we're walking on the main square. Oh, take a look. All the kids who visited this place and colored. Shark week. Yeah. It's just still hanging out on the wall. The Shark Week Gallery. Sea turtles. All the information about them. There were so many fishes inside of here. Yeah. I wish we knew exact numbers of how many. I mean, we have seen so many fish tanks, aquariums. Actually, I also wanted to know which types. That would be very cool. It's actually funny it's saying, please don't be alarmed if I'm lying in a funny position. We often rest on our sides or upside down. Oh, they were predators. Hmm. Fortunately, we don't know what animals, but they were predators. Oh, wait. Oh. Wolfish. Wolfish have anti-freeze in their blood. Where's even stairs going up? If you thought you already saw all the aquariums, there's even more. <laughs> there's just still shells laying here. Maybe we're used for decoration. So you could go up and probably get on top of the aquariums and the tanks so you could feed the animals. Oh wow. Well yeah, was one for this thing. Take a look, yeah. There would just employees be here. And they would throw the food inside of here for all the fishes. And we're also here. Yeah, well, here was another hole. Quite crazy. I mean, take a look, we're literally behind the scenes right now. Of the whole sea world. There used to be a curled octopus inside of here. That is very cool, actually. This zone is in the area of open water where sunlight can penetrate. All right. Actually, much bigger than I expected. There is a complete other part here. And where you would see if the species is common, threatened, or maybe even endangered. This was like an interactive pool where you could touch the fishes inside. And which were inside? It's not standing anywhere. Maybe jellyfish, but I can't imagine that. But that you can touch some jellyfish. Yeah, but there is a picture of them. Maybe there's a certain species of jellyfish which are not harmful. Yeah. Seems like it's leaking a lot over here. Darn. You go fetch. <laughs> <laughs> so unfortunate to see a leakage here. 
will probably lead the place to fall in a state of disrepair. Water damage is the worst an abandoned building can have. It will definitely progress the decay. Over here is actually another backstage for it. You can just see that there was a like a huge storage over here. Diving depth. So I think over here it used to be like um, deep ground animals, don't you know? Like the octopus that was just showing. Just animals who normally live way on the seas. Big tank which is just filled with rocks. Even the trash cans are still here and they are still filled. And the lost customers. This giant tank over here was actually for sharks. Take a look, spotted shark swimming with his mouth open. I do think it's pretty small for a shark. Yeah, it's where this uh, small species of uh, shark. But there's another way going up. Oh yeah, now we come above. All the huge things, have a look. Crazy. You can go even one other stair up. And now we're on the top level, above all the tanks. They were just being fed here, all the fishes. Crazy, so there was a lobster in this tank. You just had a bridge over here. You could walk around all the tanks to feed the animals. There's still water inside. Yeah. Where you had another one of these stairs to go a few levels up for the other fish tanks. All these fish tanks. And Grant actually found something in a secret room here upstairs. So we go upside of here. Again, the flags. And over here, we actually had a lot of uniforms. Looks just like a storage. Oh, yeah, take a look. Still the uniforms of the old employees up there. Crazy. Some of them are even still packed. Yeah. <laughs> Big tank you've seen. They used to feed the animals right here. Crazy, this was the big round tank. Alright, that was it, our first spot in Scotland. A crazy spot, a unique one as well, we had never seen before. Yeah, this was definitely a very unique one. And I'm very amazed that this is just being left abandoned. And it isn't abandoned for that long of a period. And yeah, the lights were still working, it was very crazy. And we just feel like employees could just walk in every single moment. Yeah, the only thing which was missing were actually the fishes inside. So, really hope you did enjoy the first spot in Scotland. We are now going on our way to the next spot in Scotland. Hopefully that one works out. You will see it next week. And after all, you know what to do guys. Like, subscribe, comment, down below, ring the bell notification button and then we will see you next time. Peace out.